two 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 day we will talk about the u.s debt 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 clock and the secret w windows that have happened over the last two weeks or so and i haven't had a chance to catch up on those yet and i was able to put some time in and put things together in an organized way to actually explain how they tie into gold silver and even crypto and in particular uh the crypto xrp right now so here is an overview or part of an overview of what has happened with this uh, secret window thing since about uh, October 17th. I've talked about them through about here and on October 30th it had a particularly interesting one regarding uh, the, uh, the ending of the U.S. gold uh, standard in 1971. I apologize about that one, but I didn't have a word on a screen to point to, so you just got to bear with me. Uh, as always, p p play these at 1.75x to work through those much quicker. Um, and then on the first, it had the uh, Federal Reserve Vault that appears as if it's shut down and it's almost a portal. And there are some types that have c c claimed that the pattern in the uh, c coverings on this is actually significant and in part because it does have an X on there. So here it is in more de 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 detail. Um, I have explained these. So like for instance, you're talking about um, some uh, CBDC against yacht uh, in particular here then you have the uh, Federal Reserve money creation scheme uh, that has a lot of information in that one that I have co covered and then this one and this one are newer um, and then you have another one that has been put t together uh, that shows um, them all in a little bit different way, including the November 7th one, which in my opinion was not that important. Um, at this point, I do think that whoever is uh, behind this is not really releasing uh, incredibly unknown information. However, f it is helping people to uh, see the information that I and we probably are already very aware of in regards to how the uh, US do dollar is essentially just imaginary uh, paper money at this point in time. And it uh, t t talks about the education s s system, which it's not wrong at all. It's just and I think that, that they might be just uh, tr 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 trying to f f farm engagement at this point. So as far as the one from October 30th goes, which is the one that I have been most interested in, uh, primarily because there have been some that say that this X here and it's gold might refer to uh, crypto and XRP. Um, however, there are some interesting explanations as well. I won't touch on this one too terribly much. However, in this part two, there is a very interesting po point made. Um, nope, it was not that one, uh, which is an Abraham Lincoln one. And uh, in regards to the gr greenbacks, it does have XX on here though, which I hypothesized could mean uh, could mean XRP and uh, and XLM because that does have a lot of uh, quant quantum financial system uh, hypotheses around those. But I want to concentrate more on the one that happened on October thirty first. Um, part one on this 
So whoever th- th- this account is, um, they post a lot of things about Israel, and I don't want to get into that. Um, I think a lot of it is interesting, and a lot of it is true, but I think it's kind of a stretch in some ways but it does have some really interesting um things that do correlate so on this uh chart um which you can see more uh here until i get it actually organized on the screen 1948 1971 and 2020 well in 1948 uh the uh, corporation of the country of Israel was actually established. 1971 is when the U.S. moved away f- from g- gold, and the value of our c- c- currency has uh, gone down from uh, a relative v- value of 100% in 1971 to about uh, f- 3% of the value in 1971 t- today. And that is uh, primarily due to inflation f- f- caused by the pr- pr- printing of more and more paper USD. So um, th- those points are made here, but the X on the plug is uh, called out in a different way here. So XAU is gold, XAG, silver, XCU, copper, XPT, platinum. And I also talk a lot about the connections with crypto and gold and silver. Um, In particular, uh, with the BRICS countries and with Ripple being partnered up with so many of them, that want to move towards what is rumored to be a uh, an, an asset backed currency, which is then rumored to, to be heavily off of gold. So there is a lot of connection in between what I talk about and uh, these other kinds of um, uh, exploratory thought experiments, I guess. So if we move into the Federal Reserve one, um, that one's not too terribly interesting in my opinion. This is where money c- 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 comes from. It's it's essentially just c- coming out of thin air. Um, I didn't think that the analysis on that was uh, particularly interesting. Um, I do just want to remind us that the, the Federal Reserve is not a part of the U.S. G- 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 government. It is a private c- corporation, and it was called the Federal Reserve just to make it sound as if it was federal and if it was actually uh, the uh, reserve of our c- 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 currency. It is not either of those things. It's essentially a uh, company that does uh, contracting work for the U.S. government to print uh, to print off all of our cash and USD. Um, The one from November 7th, as I said, I don't think it's that uh, ground breaking. Um, this is what made me begin to think that uh, this might just be more of like a um, marketing campaign. Might be more just trying to increase tra- traffic on their site, which it has absolutely done. But th- 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 this information here really isn't um, particularly interesting to me because uh, it's just common sense and it's a fact in my humble opinion. Um, So as far as the November 9th one goes, let's see if I can uh, find that one on here. Um, This goes up to November the 5th. Uh, November the 9th was um, a picture of the uh, decreasing value of the USD over time. I don't know why, but I can't actually... 
find that one. Oh yeah, okay. So if we just open this here, this is, uh, oh, it was actually a part of the, okay. I got it now, I got it now everyone. I'm a professional. Um, so yeah, as I explained in 1913, we created the, Federal Reserve itself, 1933, um, the U.S. confiscated all gold, 1944, we had Bretton Woods, which uh, essentially um, made the U.S. the financial powerhouse of the world, and in 1971, we moved away from from gold as a country and we have continued to crash ever since then so i was incorrect earlier the relative value of the usd has collapsed 97 percent over the last 110 years since 1913 not since 1971 but the uh the demise of it has uh gone ex uh, has gone quickly since 1971 and it continues to go down as we print more and more and we are what 33 trillion in debt right now which is almost 34 which is absolutely insane um so again i i don't think there's too much uh hidden in Information here. It is more of a hit, hit, hit historical analysis, which, if you're not f familiar with that, has tons and tons of inf information. But I just uh, don't think it's incredibly important. It it does have an interesting thing on here because it does have a picture of a where did it go of a stamp, <clears throat> um, and it does have the number s seventeen on there. And it went from, uh, which is interesting because that is the number of the presidency that some people say that tr Trump is, uh, just because all of the presidents after that one were a president of the cor corporation, not of the actual country itself, which is... A little bit more of a conspiracy than what I won't want to talk about here but it does have some interesting things that tie everything together in my um, holistic view of everything so this does talk about uh, US internal re 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 revenue tax and the uh, actual I, S T A M P S. I have a hard time with S T sounds. So uh, it's all about Fed internal re re revenue service taxation depression postage anomaly. Add to words. Yeah. So not a whole lot there. Um, and part three is more Israel. Uh, don't want to get into that because I think it's. A little bit of a personal bias here and a stretch but it is really interesting if you look back to the actual creation of is real who was involved with that and where those kinds of people are now today um, and uh, here's an interesting point to tie it back into uh, into gold and XRP um, so we can see that there are countries that have been accumulating a lot of gold. Um, that is, in particular, Russia and China, which are two of the, the, the countries uh, that uh, that combine into the main part of the BRICS organization at this point in time. Uh, and I haven't seen this before, but it was interesting to me just because there are a lot of uh, more wild uh, conspiracies out there about XRP being directly backed by the value of gold um, and that comes because uh, we have these ISO 222 um, uh, financial institution and 
banking protocol upgrades happening on November the 19th. Uh, and, and things like XRP are ISO 222 compliant. It's not the actual token itself. It is the protocol and the, uh, communication within it. So I don't believe that XRP will be directly backed by gold. That doesn't really make sense in my mind, but the idea that XRP can carry the value of gold because uh, XRP is essentially tokenizing the value of a uh, a BRICS currency that could be uh, representative of the value of c- 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 commodities like gold, s- s- silver, p- p- pretty much anything else that that organization uh, decides t- t- to uh, to actually agree to, that does make sense. So I think it's a, it is a little bit misunderstood, uh, in particular in the crypto uh, conspiracy end of things. And I think a lot of people have very inappropriately run with that. But I actually do think that Ripple and XRP are very well positioned to be able to work with these BRICS countries who might or who do want to actually use a uh, an asset backed currency, which would, uh, which could very well be backed by gold, silver, and a combination of other things.